guys, I'm super excited. I'm going to be doing a Glossier review. I bought some amazing Glossier products and I'm going to be trying them for the second time today. I'm super obsessed, so stay tuned to see how you can get this look. Excited. I know we're gonna do an intro at the end, but I'm just gonna intro a little bit here just because how do you start this? This just feels weird. But I am going to be doing a super super cute review on some Glossier makeup that I bought a while ago. I've been using it lately and I am obsessed. It's literally so amazing. But um, I'm just gonna get started. I actually had to look up the Glossier name because I didn't know how to pronounce it, but I was correct. It is Glossier, very French. But look at this packaging it is literally so cute it came in like this super cute pink box it did have like bubble wrap like wrapped around all of this so it wouldn't like spill everywhere but it was super cute just super pink and fun and it's just so cute i'm obsessed but i want to keep this box forever it came with like these really cute like little notes and like stickers too which i think is just a little fun take like not every makeup company is just gonna go this far it's just so cute i love it so I'm going to start with some super awesome foundation. This is actually a skin perfecting tint. It comes in this cute little bottle. I love that their packaging is like super minimal, super cute, and just like really clean, which I love. But I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I have tried this um, makeup before. I did do like a little Instagram live on it, but I'm super excited to do this video because I get to show you guys like in like lifetime what it looks like so I'm super excited so the way that I apply my makeup is I just like put it on the back of my hand this one comes out like super weird you like literally have to drip it on your hand and that's like the only way it comes out I don't know if you are supposed to like cut the tip off of this or something but uh it just comes out really slowly so I think we should put this in And that's good, and we're good. <laughs> I love this though, it's so great. It's like a little bit watery, but I love that because um, I have super dry skin, so I love the dewy look, and I feel like this one gives me super dewy look. Also, I don't tan my face, so don't judge me if the makeup is like 10 times darker than my face is right now. Don't judge, okay. So I just like put little dots on. Next, I'm going to put some concealer under my eyes to hide these dark circles, which is going to be very difficult, but I'm going to try and make it work. This is the Stretch Concealer. It comes in this cute little packaging. It does use that like baby pink, which I love so much. It's super cute. Um, I got to get it out. And then it comes in this cute little bottle. I've actually never seen concealer in a bottle like this, so I think this is super cool. Um, this is what it looks like on the inside. I believe this is just the color light, so I'm just going to use my fingers to apply this underneath my eye. Voila. So now we're going to go in with some blush. I can't remember the exact name of this product, but it had a super cute name, but um, this is in the color Haze. It is so super cute. It's like this peachy tone, which is just adorable. Also, it comes in this little bottle that looks like some paint. Oh, it's called Cloud Paint. I just saw it on the back, so super cute. I love it. Action 
should really leave the makeup tutorials to Elisa. <laughs> is the video. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Have a nice day. <laughs> Does it look good? <laughs> I'm just gonna apply some eyeshadow. This is a super cute eyeshadow. It's in the color Cub and it's actually a liquid eyeshadow. It kind of looks like lipstick but don't mistake it because it doesn't taste good. most loved product. This is called Boy Brow. This is just some brow gel. It is tinted. Um, I did get the color brown. I do have super dark natural brows and they're super crazy so I don't like a ton of product on my brows and I feel like this is probably the best product I have ever used for my brows. I'm obsessed. Okay. Now I'm just going to apply some mascara. It can be any mascara from your local drugstore. Okay. Now I'm going to apply some chapstick. And you can put some lipstick on to finish the look. This is not Glossier because I am unprepared. This foundation is so great. This is just a skin perfecting tint. It is in the color dark, I wanted to mention. I do want to mention that I definitely don't have like super dark skin. I'm not like super tan. So that is one thing that I didn't love about this product is that they don't have like a ton of um, different shades for their makeup. But overall, this foundation is really, really great if you just want some light coverage, like on an easy everyday foundation. So I definitely love this one. It definitely is super lightweight. It's super glossy. <laughs> glossy, you gotta love it. <laughs> So for the concealer, I did like this concealer. It is a little bit um, dewy. I wouldn't say that it gives you a bunch of coverage, but it does give you a little bit of lightening and brightening. So if that's all you need, if you don't need a ton of coverage with your concealer, this is definitely a great one. It does come in this little bottle, but I feel like a little bit goes a long way. This will probably last you a couple of months, maybe more if you don't use it every day. Um, overall, I think this is a great product. I think that you should definitely invest in this one and it is super great. So with the Lid Star eyeshadow, I love this eyeshadow. I think it's so great. It does look a little bit li like lip gloss. It does have that brush, but don't mistake it for that. It doesn't taste good, let me tell you, but it is so cute. I love that it's just light and airy, a little bit of sparkle in it, and it's just so easy to apply. You just put it on your fingertips and um, kind of blend it in and it's just a great product, like I said, for everyday wear. Definitely a light and airy product. I'm super obsessed with it. For the blush, I love this cloud paint. The packaging is so adorable. I would definitely recommend this one. I would buy this again. Make sure you just use a tiny, tiny amount. This is definitely gonna last you a very, very long time. Even though it comes in this tiny little bottle, you seriously need the smallest amount. I made the mistake of putting too much on. Don't make that mistake, but it definitely blends super well. It's just a little bit of like a healthy glow, which I love. <laughs> and for the final and the best product, is the boy brow. I'm so obsessed with this. It is so amazing. I've been using it every single day since I got this um, amazing makeup. I'm super, super obsessed. This is the best product. I definitely recommend this. Um, anyone who wants a little bit more of a full brow, this is definitely a great one. It comes in a bunch of different colors. You can get it in clear as well. This is my absolute favorite product from them. It's going to last for such a long time, but it does come in this super cute bottle. Um, <clears throat> it has this little brush. It doesn't give off too much color, which I love. I'm obsessed. It's perfect. Definitely for people with, uh, with thicker or thinner eyebrows. I love it. 
Overall, I love these products. I would totally buy from Glossier again. It's super great. They do have some really great prices too. Their products are all really amazing. If you just love that light coverage, really light and hairy look, this is definitely a great company to buy from and they have some awesome products. Thanks for watching this video, guys. I hope this helped. If you are considering buying Glossier products, I definitely highly recommend them, so go ahead and check them out. Also, make sure you're following us on all of our social media. We do have Snapchat, Instagram, Pinterest, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. Uh, we love talking to you guys, so make sure you find us at Nanamax, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and we'll see you guys later. retro glam mascara that I get from your local drugstore. Super easy. I just use it like on an everyday. Are you mad? What? Did I say something? Because I said drugstore? Like a Walgreens, honey! <laughs> what? Girl, you look good. It's not good. I just want everyone to know that when I say drugstore, I mean your local Walgreens, your CVS, your Target, not, not what Elisa's thinking. Also, there are not stores that sell drugs. That's just a, a friendly PSA for me. So for the cloud, the cloud paint. Oh my goodness, can't talk. This is like two minutes of video. <laughs> if your eyebrows shit, I do not recommend this product. Oh, shit. I got lots of eyebrows. <laughs> so I didn't. In This is the color herb. We're just gonna go ahead and go. Oh. This is great if you want a really earthy look. Nice green tint. Oh, that. Oh, that tastes horrible. So, this is not lip gloss. I'm just gonna let you all know this is eyeshadow. <laughs> So these stickers are actually meant to go on your face. You can put them literally anywhere. This is like the new trend. Like if you put it on your chin, that's really cute. Definitely put the eyeballs on your eyelid. Cause even when my eyes close, you know I'm washing you. 